Good morning, all you lovely people out there. If you remember last week, I was 21 requests behind. <laughs> and now this week, I'm 15 behind because I did six last week. And I have another six here to do today, which will make me nine behind next week. <laughs> so we're getting there slowly but surely. Uh, I'll read the first three requests to you. The first one is, let all things now living, a song of thanksgiving to God the Creator triumphantly raise, who fashioned and made us, protected and stayed us, who guideth us on to the end of our days. His banners are o'er us, his light goes before us, a pillar of fire shining forth in the night. Till shadows have vanished and darkness is banished, to God in the highest, Hosanna and praise. The second one is, Jesus shall reign where'er the sun doth his successive journeys run. His kingdom spread from shore to shore till moons shall wax and wane no more. And the third one is, my father is rich in houses and lands. He holdeth the wealth of the world in his hands of rubies and diamonds, of silver and gold. His coffers are full, he has riches untold. My father's own son, the saviour of men, once wandered on earth as the poorest of them. But now he is pleading our pardon on high, that we may be his when he comes by and by. I'm a child of the king, a child of the king. With Jesus my Saviour, I'm a child of the King.
Now I've got three more here. Um, I'll read them out. The first one is, This is my Father's world, and to my listening ears, all nature sings, and round me rings the music of the spheres. This is my Father's world. I rest me in the thought of rocks and trees and skies and seas, his hand the wonders wrought. The second one is, Saviour again to thy dear name we raise, with one accord our parting hymn of praise. We stand to bless thee ere our worship cease, then, lowly kneeling, wait thy word of peace. Grant us thy peace, throughout our earthly life, our balm in sorrow and our stay in strife. Then when thy voice shall bid our conflict cease, call us, O Lord, to thine eternal peace. And the last one is, O soul, are you weary and troubled? No light in the darkness you see. There's light for a look at the Saviour and life more abundant and free. Turn your eyes upon Jesus, look full in his wonderful face, and the things of earth will grow strangely dim in the light of his glory and grace.
turn your eyes upon Jesus. Our blessed Saviour, who will come by and by. I've got a lovely reading here in John 1. Selected verses here from John 1 about our precious Saviour. And this is our Saviour um, that we should turn our eyes on. And the Saviour who died for us. And the Saviour who made the world and formed everything out of nothing. Um, together with the Father and the Holy Spirit. The blessed three in one. So I've got a lovely word here from John 1. Um, and in this I love it because Jesus is called the Word with a capital W. He is the Word of life in this precious Bible and in his precious life and his precious death. He is all we need. So I'll read these selected verses here in John 1. In the beginning was the Word, and the Word was with God, and the Word was God. The same was in the beginning with God. All things were made by him, and without him was not anything made that was made. In him was life, and the life was the light of men. He was in the world, and the world was made by him, and the world knew him not. He came unto his own, and his own received him not. But as many as received him, to them gave he the power to become the sons of God, even to them that believe on his name, which were born not of blood, nor of the will of the flesh, nor of the will of man, but of God. And the word was made flesh and dwelt among us, and we beheld his glory, the glory as of the only begotten of the Father, full of grace and truth. So this is, this is the beautiful person that that lovely verse chorus is talking about. Turn your eyes upon Jesus. So that's um, what I have for today. And I pray that God will richly bless it to all of your hearts. And I love you all. And I will see you next week. God bless you immensely. Bye.